What's up guys and welcome back with some more Genshin Impact. The new update just came out and we are about to do Beto's Hangout event. Which it's taken a long time to get here for the fact that Beto's been out forever. But if there was a time for it to come out, I mean, it makes sense now because of Inazuma, of course. So yeah, we're going to get straight into this and it seems to be over here in the middle of water. Because why not? <laughs> right? So if you enjoyed this video, be sure to like, share, comment, subscribe, all that good stuff. It's greatly appreciated. You are also able to um, go to the channel and go to the Genshin Impact playlist section and you'll see all the Genshin content there. Oh my gosh. I should have known this was going to happen. I should have expected this. I'm not even surprised. Well, be right back. <laughs> okay, and we're back. We are good to go. So I need to go up higher over here and... Where is she? Okay, she's here. <laughs> I was like, huh? <laughs> well, would you look who's here? Looks like it's going to be a day to remember. Guys, look who the sea washed up. Yeah, uh, me. <laughs> Ahoy there, traveler. Ahoy, mate. <laughs> so Captain really did invite you to join the homecoming celebration. You always had an eye patch? I heard that you took care of another crisis while you were in Inazuma. Are the rumors true? Yes, That's I saved right. the world from, um, Thanks collapse. Thanks to you, Inazuma's vision hunt decree was finally put to an end. While Scaramouche well got away with the Gnosis, yes. The has got quite the eye for people. She said she was sure that your trip to Inazuma would stir up some waves. And sure hey. enough... I mean, all I wanted was a chat with the Electro Archon. That's all. Don't worry about it. <laughs> you being so modest. We all know what you did to protect Liyue Harbor. I've heard that they tell stories about you and Mondstadt, too. The honorary knight. Pretty impressive. Ah, uh, y'all are just buttering me I'd up as always. Your caliber would be right at home in the cracks. Right, sailors? <laughs> That's right. Wow, I'm getting excited just thinking of being the traveler's crewmate. Hey, thanks. Why do you say we arm wrestle? I mean <laughs> I was worried you'd be too busy to show up. Of oh, course, Jesus. Captain on deck! Freaking physics, what the hell? <laughs> so we were just trying to talk the traveler into joining the crew. Yeah, come on, yeah. Captain Beto. Surely you've got a way to get the traveler on board. Oh, he's on board right now for the celebration, isn't he? Of course. Yeah, but just one celebration together is not enough. You know what we mean, Captain. Uh, all right, all right, I get it What's now. going on? There is something special about you, traveler. You earned everyone's respect, myself included. Thanks. So it goes without saying that the Crux would be honored to have a crew member such as yourself. Appreciate no doubt it. about that. But then again, a hero like yourself doesn't just set off on a journey without some bigger purpose in mind. So should a hero really drop what they're doing just to spend day after day drifting at sea with us? I mean, I ain't, I'm not doing much except my daily commissions right now. <laughs> crux, sure. For always Waiting for forward to the next, the next region. Instead be holding Sumeru. Back. Right. Uh, I guess we didn't think that part through. Remember... Rather than seeking out strong members to join us, you should be focusing on making yourselves the strongest that you can be. If we are powerful, they will come to us. Isn't that why everyone here chose to come aboard in the first place? Yes. A strong sailor is always looking for a sturdy ship. I guess I almost forgot the first lesson you ever taught me. Thanks for the reminder, Captain. <laughs> Just be sure you all keep that in mind. Now, there's no more need to hound the Traveler, as you were. The Traveler and I have something to discuss. Of course, business, as you would say. I'm glad Strictly you business. Came. Welcome back aboard. Um, okay, so we have you are a wise leader. The crew seemed excited to see me. Thanks for helping me out back there. Yeah, thanks. I don't mention it. As a host, it would be pretty embarrassing to continue letting my guests be put on the spot like that course i can't go getting too caught up in my own reputation though that's certainly not how the crux made it to where we are today mm -hmm. as the head can't of the drink fleet, too much of your own to right kool-aid as they say no how turbulent the seas may become but then again the crew isn't usually this even though i don't up. drink kool-aid <laughs> it's not that they're arrogant they're just bubbling with ambition that's all that's fair their excitement today comes from their great respect for you both your strength and your character so please don't take it the wrong way uh, why would I? I should be thanking them for taking me to Inazuma. Why would I? I'm actually quite interested in the life of a sailor. Oh, I'll go with the Inazuma thing. Great. 
Actually, speaking of Inazuma, I think your good luck must have rubbed off on me on the way over. I made an interesting find on the beach shortly after we parted ways. Which you find. Let's talk about it over there, where it's a little quieter. Okay. But you, uh, what you got going on over here? Go to a quiet spot to talk details with Beto. So after we dropped you off in Rito, we found a shipwreck nearby. Probably belonged to Inazuma and pirates. Mm, okay. We searched the wreckage and found a map. At first, I thought it was a nautical chart. I was thinking we might discover a new sailing route if we were lucky. But after a closer look, I realized it wasn't a map of the sea at all. It was a Liyue treasure map, and no ordinary... Man, the way she map. said Liyue. Oh. Is there a demonic presence in the area? Um, nothing like that. <laughs> I just mean that the map was a mess. So it was the most I could do to figure out that the treasure Demons. was probably in Liyue. As for its exact location, I have no idea. Okay, wonderful. I'd say I've explored Liyue pretty extensively, but still, <laughs> this one managed to beat me. So, I thought of you. Nobody can beat you when it comes to treasure hunting on land, right? I mean, he said, you know me too well. I wouldn't say I'm the best treasure hunter of all, of all time. Only the best to date. Is yeah. that right? <laughs> yeah. Well, then, it looks Don't like worry about it. I know what I'm Here's doing. Here's the map. See what you can make of it. Yeah. What the hell, dude? So, um, where do you think it is? Uh... Is that Gilly's Plain or just Kinsei Village? Gilly's Plain, Gilly yeah. Gilly Plains. Huh, I never would have gotten that. How can you tell? Uh, compared to our regular map, that yeah, the topography, uh, topography, oh my god, topography, oh my god, why was that so bad? I'm leaving that in the video. <laughs> of the area most closely resembles the Gilly Plains, oh. yeah. Okay, then. So you do live yes. up to the hype. Yes, of course. <laughs> I can't believe you noticed that. I hope you I sure chose the right place. Oh, I hope Let's I chose the right place. Let's head over there and place. take a look. I'll need you to help me zero in on the specific location once we're there. If it's not there, it's a GG. <sighs> Ma'am, don't worry about it. I'm an expert when it comes to this type of stuff. I would never, ever lead somebody in the wrong direction, acting like I knew where I was going. Only an amateur would do that. And we're not amateurs. We're professionals. This is what we do on a daily basis. We get things More done. Speed. As you will see right now. Watch and learn. See, the treasure hoarders are here. It should be around here, right? Yes. Mm -hmm. Who are they? Treasure hoarders. Oh, it's a bunch of treasure hoarders. <laughs> I guess the treasure's for real, then. See? Big brain. Big brain. There are quite a few of them. If things go south and fists start flying, stay behind me. I think you forget that I'm able to fight. <laughs> I'm more than a match for these amateurs. I mean, yeah, if you want to body him, go ahead. I mean, I don't mind. You could go in there and just murder him real quick. Keep digging, boys. Once we have our hands on the treasure, everyone gets a share. Whose name is Golden Alligator? You can all hold it right there. Huh? Who's that barking orders? Do you know who you're up against here? Keep going if you got a death wish. Well, if you keep what going, if you want a death it's, wish. It's... Oh, they know who she is. Captain B B Beto. B -b 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 run, boys, run! <laughs> Nobody move. Uh, Captain Beto, Lord of the Ocean. This is all my fault. I didn't know who I was up against. I, I don't have a death wish. I swear. I got a big mouth is all. It's always saying things it shouldn't. I swear I'll wash it out with soap the moment I get back. Mm-hmm. <laughs> have mercy. Will you spare us? <laughs> well, spare them, at least. These guys are just trying to put food in their mouths. They'd never hurt a soul. Didn't you just say that there was a death wish if, if we would have continued? Me. Please, let them go. Isn't that what you just said? It was me that disrespected you. They never did and never would. Is that right? You would have disrespected Fine. anybody else that was here. Seems like you've got a heart in there somewhere, seeing how you treat your crew. I'll let you off the hook this time. Get out of here! Thank you, Captain Beto. Thank you. Wait. Yes? What else might Where's the that treasure at? mighty Beto require? This man in simple mode now. This treasure's still up for grabs. The Crux Fleet honors the rule of first come, first served. 
You found it first, so name your price. I can't have any rumors going around about Captain Beto stealing other people's treasure. Shouldn't we make sure I? the treasure's actually Captain here Beto, first? We wouldn't dare take more from you. D take the treasure as an apology for my foolish words. I mean, that works. Please, take it. Please. Uh, that works. Oh, well, if you insist. She's like, I don't got to spend no I money, say less. your kind offer and I'll make you one in return. You don't seem like terrible folks, so let me help you get onto the right track. If you want to mend your ways and put all this behind you, the Crux can probably arrange some odd jobs in the port for you. It'd be humble work, but at least it'd get you on your feet and making an honest living. A much better deal than what you've got going now, if you ask me. See? Wow, uh, She's caring. Thank you, Captain Beto. On behalf of me and all my boys. Salute, brother. All right. All right. Is the treasure Let's actually see what here? We've got in here. Investigate suspicious locations so what nearby. For. Let's Treasure, you hear? Maybe we'll find it. Those rocks look kind of weird. Say less. Fish power. <laughs> is is there anything looking. here? If there's no treasure here, then you know, uh, I wasn't the one who said it was here. It was all a lie. I heard it from what the treasure hoarders. What are trolls digging for? Wait, actually, I've heard they sometimes dig for buried treasure. Let's go take a closer look. Yeah, let's do that. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Every little thing's gonna be all right. Don't worry about it. This might be overkill just for like some hill churls and stuff, but I mean, it's treasure we're talking about here. There could potentially be millions of mora, or there could just be like nothing. Like, and it's just gonna be really depressing. But I mean, hey, you never know. My level 90 fish Eula is untouchable. Let me tell you. Nope, not here either. Oh dear. Now that we've searched all the places of interest in this area and come up with nothing, well, you got any ideas? I mean, what's the treasure you were looking for? It's a... Uh... Captain Beto! Captain Beto! Huh? Huh? Hey, what brings you back here? Captain Beto! Actually, we've just been wandering around nearby. We didn't go far. Because we were thinking about what you said and... Uh-huh. Well... Me and the boys decided we're ready to move away from all of this and get on the straight and narrow. They said. Oh? Are you sure? Yes. Absolutely sure. Okay, then. But I'll warn you right now, you won't have it easy. It might just be menial work in the port, but in the eyes of the general public, you'll be associates of the crux. So there'll be a grueling test you have to go through before you can start. I understand. I understand. Truth be told, Captain... It's only because it's you, the mighty and honorable Captain Beto. If it had been anyone else, I don't think I'd have listened. Mm -hmm. And since you made us this kind offer, I'd like to ask if I might be so bold. Is there any hope at all for us to become full members of the Crux in the future? Even the tiniest shred of hope? <laughs> well, there's no place in the Crux for delusions of grandeur, that's for sure. Hmm. But then again... Everybody I mean, you got a long way to go, there. likely, but I mean, so, uh... it comes down to you. If you manage to impress me and earn the respect of my crew, then yeah, nothing's impossible. Uh, thank you, Captain Beto. Thank you. <laughs> I love that. Times over. I couldn't help but notice you were searching for something Synchronized. else. Synchronized. It still hasn't turned up. Why? Do you have any clues? We heard about two treasures, both in Gwaley Plains. We were still looking for the first one when you found us. So maybe the other one might be what you're looking for. Where is not it? Not too far from here, but I'm just not sure of the exact location. All the info we oh, got dear. about this treasure came from the black market. The answer's hidden inside a poem which goes like this. <clears throat> Drunkenly I gazed at the ruins long forsaken, and lay beneath red leaves whose branches cast a crooked shade. The dusk sun shone upon the sea as I awakened. But Guyan stood twixt weary eyes in the sight of home they crave. Beautiful. Absolutely. <laughs> Absolutely As beautiful. For the ruins long forsaken part, I do know of some ruins near here. Okay, sounds but good. Beyond that line, I just... I don't... I'm just not smart enough. It's okay, <laughs> So a treasure clue hidden in a poem, huh? Don't worry, we got this. Of course See we my do. my friend here? If they taught treasure hunting as an art form, you'd probably be calling him Grandmaster. 
This kind of thing's a piece of cake for him. Exactly. Right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um. Yeah, I have no interest in being a grandmaster <laughs> of anything. Yeah. Okay, yeah. then. Let's start by heading to the site and surveying the scene. She's going to be so disappointed if we don't find this treasure. Okay. Come on, boys. You heard the captain. Lead the way. I did not expect this to go like this. More speed. This story's going way differently than I imagined it to, but hey. Hopefully it ends well, at least. If we end up opening up some empty chests, this is going to be a mess. These are the long forsaken ruins from the poem. Apparently they were once full of treasure. But judging by the state of them now, it's probably long gone. Hmm, it seems that we need to dig deeper into this poem. Drunkenly, I gazed at the ruins long forsaken and lay beneath red leaves whose branches cast a crooked shade. The dusk sun shone upon the sea as I awakened but Guyan stood twixt weary eyes and the sight of home they crave. <sighs> Do you have any ideas? Uh, maybe gazed at the ruins means the writer wasn't right here, but... Ah, uh, somewhere you can see the ruins from. So, somewhere not too far from here? The second line means there's probably a red-leaved tree around. Yeah, and maybe the shadow cast by the tree is supposed to hint at something. The third line... Perhaps the dusk sun has something to do with the timing? Oh, I got it! This guy fell asleep and woke up just before sunset! Genius! Dusk and the shadow of a red leaf tree... Hmm... I think we can work with that. Let's take a look around. I think we're getting close. Alright, let's do it! Sounds good to me. All the clues in the poem to look for the treasure. Yes, yes. Right here? We good? Found it. I was looking around for like and two minutes and we found it. The treasure is <laughs> finally in our hands. A check from the Northland Bank. Uh -huh. You really came through. We found the spot in no time. Without your help, I don't think I ever would have gotten my hands on it. Uh, is it worth a lot of Not more? Not much, but enough for an average person to survive on for a while. But there's more to this particular check than that. Which is? When I found the treasure map, it was tightly sealed inside a small bottle along with a letter. Okay. I'll let you read it for yourself. If you find this bottle, I may no longer be in this world. I originally Finished. thought... Oh, no. Okay, I originally thought that she was going to keep talking. Uh, these uh, pirates, having their ways and means, might be able to send me back to Liyue, which is why I got on board their ship. I never expected that. Ah, forget it. I suppose this is what they call destiny. Before I came to Inazuma, I was worried that my old mother's place would be burgled, as she lives alone. So I left a check for all the mora I've saved over the past few years buried in the location marked on this map. Please help me retrieve that check and exchange it at the Northland Bank. The mora will then be yours to do with as you please. Save for a small portion. Well, save for a small portion that I would like used to pay my mother's living expenses. Her name is uh, Minamoto Otomi, and she lives in the Gili Plains. Please do this for me and thank you. I'm sorry, mother. I found loads of those Sakura blooms that could be found all over your homeland, but it's a shame that I cannot send them to your side. Well, damn. So it's the dying wish of a man who met a tragic fate. So it's the last will of a faithful yeah. son, yeah. I can't fault him for what he did, but the way things turned out, all I can say is life is unpredictable. Yeah, well, you could say that let's again. Let's fulfill his final wish by taking this check to where it belongs. Damn. This game really knows how to get depressing out of nowhere. They're great at that. Well, let's let's do, do what he wanted it uh, wanted to be done. Let's head right over here. Yeah, like I was saying before, it, it it took me a sec to it took me a sec to find that that area. But then once I looked at the poem, I'm like, oh, okay. I just needed to look at the poem again, and I was good. Go to the wooden house by the sea. Here we are. Huh? Oh, is that his mom? Well, this is it. Oh, boys, it's time for your first job. Oh my God, you're giving them the worst first job ever to tell the freaking mom that his son or her son died. Give this check to the old lady who lives in that wooden hut. Tell her it's a welfare payment from the Liyue Ministry of Civil Affairs. 
Oh boy. Yes, boss. What's up? Um, I have some Sakura blooms that I picked up in an Azuma. I want her to have them. <laughs> I see. Oh, that was nice but of us. You only find Sakura blooms in certain places, right? It must have been quite a bit of work collecting all these. Don't surely. worry about it. Let's it's all good. Pick one, huh? One's enough to show that you care. You've already helped me out so much today. You take out a Sakura. Okay, off you go then. Take her the Sakura Bloom along with the check. And if she asks, tell her your child in a faraway land sends his best wishes. Don't want to crush her, her old heart, you know? Oh, <laughs> that's, that's cute. So, as the Sakura from one's homeland sink into the sea, so the... Uh, so too, the wandering sun stops it delivered to his mother. Wow. This ended up being a lot more touching than I thought it was going to end up being. I thought we were just going to not find any treasure or anything, but we really did find a treasure in the end. It was a touching moment, and without that, without that mother knowing, a form of closure in the way, you know? That was, that was a sweet way to, to end that. So there it is. Beto's hangout mission, at least... My first playthrough of one. <laughs> I did not. I just really didn't expect it to go like this. But if you enjoyed this video, be sure to like, share, comment, subscribe. All that good oh stuff is greatly appreciated. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Freaking. Huh? Zinchu All over here. Okay, Zinchu. Okay, okay, Zinchu. Okay. Okay. Shh. But yeah, like, share, comment, subscribe. All that good stuff. Join the Discord server. It's free to join. Uh, below, we're on the road to 3,000 subscribers. Uh, Genshin Impact playlist on the channel has all the Genshin content I've done. My reactions, my playthroughs, all that. And other than that, appreciate y'all, love y'all, stay safe, and as always, don't do crack. Be sure to subscribe to the Special K Experience if you enjoyed this video. If not, you're going to Femboy IHOP.